In Houston's spacious Astrodome, there were grumblings to be heard instead of rumbling. And the grumbling came from Oiler quarterback Charlie Johnson, number 12, who had a right to be upset by the way the Miami Dolphins defense was treating him. Led by number 75, Manny Fernandez, the Miami quarterback crushers caused problems for Johnson all afternoon. When they didn't physically get to him, they forced him to rush his passes. Then, when he was able to complete a pass, the hard-hitting Dolphins came up the winners. Perhaps it was the glare from the Astrodome ceiling, or perhaps it was the wizardry of Miami's quarterback Bob Greasy that kept the Oilers confused. At any rate, Greasy scrambled recklessly used his blockers well, and made himself generally obnoxious to the Oilers. His second period pass to rookie Jim Mandich, number 88, gave the Dolphins a lead they never relinquished. In the third period, it was Greasy to number 81, Howard Twilley, and Miami led 17 to three. The Oilers finally got themselves together, and behind the receiving and running of tight end Alvin Reed, number 89, they seemed determined not to become the victims of an upset. When number 32, running back Hoyle Granger, took over the chores, he finally managed to crash in for a touchdown. But it wasn't enough, as the Miami Dolphins served notice that when they put it all together, they're going to be tough. 